Boxing Ego here. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon on the top of your screen to get notified when the latest new content drops. One. Oscar De La Hoya says Canelo vs Triple G2 is back on for September. Stay tuned. What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel for the latest and greatest in boxing if you want to become part of the gang, gang. Notification gang, please hit the bell icon. Shout out to the Super Chat channel donations, the Venmo donations, and the Patreon family. We working. Golden Boys Oscar De La Hoya says, I'm happy to inform that we have a fight September 15th, exclamation mark. Hashtag Canelo Triple G2. And he posted the deal or no deal. And it lights up and says deal on his social media. You guys can check that out. You'll see a screenshot in this particular video. So the fight is back on. I figured this, I did a video with ESPN's um, phone call where De La Hoya was saying, oh, no fight, no fight. But I figure it would still happen. That's why I didn't really say too much. I said, is this really no fight or is it like theatrics to build up the intensity, make fans want it? Or maybe they really had some issues behind the scenes negotiating. I don't know what the final asking price is or the final deal that was accepted, but according to the man in charge at Golden Boy, Oscar De La Hoya, we ain't now have a fight. Now, one of the reasons why I figured a fight would happen, as you guys heard on some of my previous live streams, is there's multiple things. Triple G, he's not getting any younger. Two, he was stripped of the IBF belt, and he was warned by the WBC, hey, there's a lot of money in it for you, for everyone involved, you should fight Canelo. There was headlines that said, WBC Suleiman urges Triple G, and they said, if you don't, rules are rules and your mandatory is is charlo so that was kind of a warning like hey if you're not fighting canelo the fight will make an exception for then you have to take your mandatory which is charlo so to me triple g like i said in those videos he was kind of cornered because you're gonna pass up 42.5 percent or whatever and then fight charlo for much less money or get stripped which would look horrible if you got stripped and two titles taken of yours in one year you know what i mean so i figured they would get it done somehow some way i knew it wasn't going to get done with the 50 50 so we've been pretty on point with this situation that's my latest thoughts i told you it was getting to the point where the drama for me was becoming overwhelming like i just want to see him if they're gonna run it back for the fans let's see it you know what i mean but it was getting a little bit played out just the back and forth politic pissing contest. I want 42.5%. No, I want 43%. You know what I mean? I was getting fed up and it was getting to the point where I wouldn't even mind seeing Canelo Daniel Jacobs. I wouldn't mind seeing Triple G versus Charlo more so than Canelo Triple G. But again, it's a, it's a good fight. It's a fight that the fans need closure for. So I'm happy that they were able to get a deal done. Let me know who wins the fight. I don't know what they have planned. They're probably not gonna do a press tour because all the drama and the Clint Buterall, Clint Gate, and back and forth negotiations and everything that's been publicized with this particular fight has helped build it. They might do like they did last time and just do a press conference in LA or something. But September's right around the corner. Guys need to get in the fight training camps. I seen Canelo was training. I did a video about it. I'm sure Triple G, when he gets back from Russia, where he's currently at, he'll start his training. And we'll get to see. Let me know who wins the rematch. Drop your thoughts in the comment section. Make sure you smash the like button. As always, hate, comment, and subscribe. Till next video's Ego Sunday. So if you enjoyed this video and want more content like this on the channel, you can show your appreciation by going to the PayPal donate button or the YouTube support button. And you can donate any amount that you feel is equivalent to the value of this video. Much more to come. Thank you guys for your support. Boxing Ego, the future of boxing. Yeah.